Alrighty guys, so it took me a while to find a wine bottle opener, but here we are. So while I'm in this process, I'm drinking the blend that just came out of that barrel over there. It is 50% uh, weeded bourbon, quarter rye, high rye bourbon, and a quarter rye whiskey. Um, I'm currently not releasing what exactly it is, mainly because I don't remember. Um, but my next go around, I'm going to record it better and do more science to it. Um, but it's really good. It only aged about a week in this barrel, and it is totally different. So much more oak and char, but it's really, really good. It also knocked down some of the rye notes. All right, so let's open this bottle up and pour it. I'm not going to do this on camera. <laughs> All right, got that cut. Me trying to mess with the... As you can tell, I'm not used to opening wine bottles that much. I love wine every now and then. Like I said, this is my favorite. It's about anything dry I really love. But uh, I'm much more of a beer and especially much more of a whiskey guy. All right, let's see. This is also a brand new opener. It's a cheap one. So y'all might watch me make a huge mess. Who's to say? Dude, there we go. Uh, yep, huge mess. It's all right though. We got it. Look at that beautiful cork. That's not blood. That's wine. Mmm. I love this wine. If there's any left over, I might have to. Might have to have a glass. Let's pour. We did this a little slowly because I'm pretty sure I have more wine in this bottle than I do. Barrel. Let's see. Oh, crap. Ignore the spilled whiskey. So this is a one liter barrel, but apparently that one liter stands for the volume of water displaced by the barrel. So that's the outside of the barrel, not the inside. It actually holds less. How much less I am still trying to figure out. So I didn't have a full 750 bottle of whiskey earlier. So that, and I also say some in a little, little jar. Maybe it'll hold the whole bottle. We're just gonna try it. I have wipes to me. Heck yeah. All right. I mean, there's no tasting of the wine, but that's okay. Uh, dropped it. There's going to be a nice thorough cleaning of this room right after this video. Alrighty. That's in there. Now I will update you weekly on its progress and push it through it. This will be the place to find all my barrel projects. I have another one in the works and I get a new barrel. It's going to involve bourbon and the Freud. So let's keep out, look out for that. All right, guys, this is Austin signing off. Follow me on Instagram at bourbon underscore in underscore college. Go to my blog at bourboninandcollege.com. Listen to my podcasts on all your favorite podcasting networks. Uh, if you need links to that, go look in my website. But if you search bourbon and college, it should pop up. 
and follow, like, and subscribe this video on YouTube. See y'all later. Hey, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you like my channel, give it a subscription. Um, follow me on Instagram at bourbon underscore in underscore college. Thanks for watching.